One last look at our hotel room. Getting ready to head from LA to Atlanta this morning. It's gonna be a long day. But yeah, we've been here about uh, three weeks. So we got some trash in the corner to pick up, but we're ready to go. Nice is cold. It's too early for her. It's uh, 2.15, 2.20. So we're gonna head out. Going to LAX. <laughs> outside of the hotel at uh, 2 a.m. Nothing's going on here, but we're getting ready to head back to Atlanta. Got a private bus. Got a private bus. I'm going to the airport. You look good. That don't happen too often at the chairs. Wait a minute, it's 3 o'clock. We'll there soon. So it's about 3.20 and there's no one here at Delta. The first flight looks like it goes out at 5.30, so they should be here soon, but not a single person in the Delta area. And the music kind of sounds like that Bluey show theme song. Well, they showed up at like uh, about 30. Uh, and apparently TSA doesn't know until 4.15 now, but we're heading over that way to see what we can do. Pretty straightforward process though once they got there. What were you saying? And don't book an, an early flight before 6 if you fly that LAX. I'm just saying. Don't make your life harder. Then it has to be. We're going to check out the Delta Sky Lounge. See what it's like. It's not open yet. we got about like 10 minutes. Some hours for you. Alright, heading on up to the lounge. Ooh. Ah. So we got some food over here, and then we got some seating over here. We're gonna find a seat first and grab some food. Ooh, a fancy bar, look at that. It kind of looks like the one from JFK. And it's got these private little lounges too, so if you ever had to do work, you have the option to do some work. So here's what I got. And there's definitely a smorgasbord of stuff up there. They have a Coke Freestyle, which is nice. Uh, and I just got some sausage yogurt, pineapple, and I saw the ham. I didn't see the sausage, so I got the ham and then found the sausage, so go both. Let's see what Nacy gets. Here's Nacy's plate. She got some egg, a hard-boiled egg, some potatoes, some ham, some cheese. Breakfast crunch salad. Breakfast crunch salad. What's the drink? It's a cherry lemonade. Ooh, cherry lemonade. Zero cherry lemonade. So what do you think about the That's setup? Good. Yeah. Oh, it's a lot like JFK's. I like it. It's nice and chill this morning. Yeah. I'll take it. I don't know about chill. My foot's gotten run over. I've gotten ran into about four times. I don't know how chill this place is, but... I have had a different experience. <sighs> you sure? Got, what, like an hour until we got a board? Yeah, we got it at 5.20, so we probably got about like an hour and ten minutes or so. Yeah. Let's have some breakfast, and then we'll have breakfast again on the plane, too. Yeah, you can see what we got first class. Heading out of the lounge. See the bar over there? Once we get to our gate, we'll talk about our experience in the lounge and what we thought of it. Yeah, here it is. It's nice. Can't beat free food and drink. I don't even have magazines. All right, we've made it to our 32A. All staff bypasses. Your seat has been clean. Welcome to board. Check it out. Gordon, James All right, Cruz, Christine Robertson, Keith Price, Joel. All right, we're heading on board. Doop, 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 doop. Fit check for you. That's my gap. Pretty good. Nancy has about a bus length over on her side. Videos. And here's what the rest of the plane looks like. Yeah, that's what the plane looks like. There's our luggage coming to the plane. You can see the pink one on the top and the blue one on the top. Those are our luggages, I'm pretty sure. Nancy got her cranberry vodka. I got a Coke. Three 
free flight. Drink your drinks. Don't get this yesterday. so far but not too bad but there's their view it's really pretty down there that's desert for sure here is the french toast croissant some butter and then macy got the quiche macy's passing out Yeah, we'll give it a try and we'll let you know what we think. So there's what it looks like from the inside. The uh, French toast was really cinnamon. Not bad, but it's really cinnamony and really like a thick, like a hollow bread. But the yogurt's not bad either. It's got yogurt, it's uh, granola, and then it looks like some peaches. It's not too tasty. It tastes pretty good. The combination of the flavors really good. I'm not sure about the croissant, it's, it's just extra carbs after the French toast. I don't know about a bad breakfast. So, what do you think? I was the quiche. Yeah, look at that construction. 
construction. Train. Almost a baggage climb. It's the bucks. So we're waiting for our ride. This is apparently where we get picked up. We're supposed to be at LN1. All we see is LN2. And then you see this hill area. It's just kind of where cars are parked. Hopefully we see them soon. We've made it to our room. If you want to see the full room tour, definitely check down in the show notes and subscribe if it's not on the channel yet. There's Nacy chilling out on the bed. Uh, but this is our room for the next couple days. Because you know why, guys? You want to know why we didn't go back to the mountains? Because we were supposed to go to a concert tomorrow night. We were, and it got canceled while we were in LA. So, and we already had the room, so we were like, do we want to just keep the room? We were like, yeah, why not? Yeah. So, yeah. And, and, get this. Uh, we'll talk probably a little bit more about this in the other video when we talk, do the room tour. But I tried to turn in my upgrade rewards so that we could get a suite. I didn't get the suite. Yeah. I mean, don't get me wrong. The room's nice. It's, it's, it's a decent room. It's not a bad room. But. But what's the point of having upgrades if you can't get them? And it's a Monday, y'all, so it's not even like it's a... <laughs> I'm thinking it's this hotel because, like, the vibe just was off when we got here, so... Yeah. But you'll have to check the yeah. video for the hotel to find out why. All right, we're probably going to relax. We'll probably do something later, uh, but we'll come and get you if we do. Here's out by the elevators. Now, this is directly connected, it looks like, to the mall. There's another Marriott in the distance there. Yeah, Salesforce building. I think they went out of business. There in the distance from the lounge is downtown Atlanta. And there's that mall down here in this corner right there. That's the mall. Uh, but there's downtown Atlanta. Really nice views. Look at all those pretty trees. While exploring the hotel, they clearly have some water leakage. That's never a good sign, y'all. Never a good sign. You definitely get overwhelmed by that smell of chlorine, but here's the pool. It's massive. Definitely gives you like the Greek vibes. There's a spa up top there. We'll check that out in a sec. But this is the pool. Pretty nice. Here is the floor plan floor for you. Wow, I'm stuttering today. So we're heading towards the check-in, but over this way is a mall entrance. So if you go over that way, you can actually go into the mall. Yeah, we might go there tomorrow since our concert was canceled. <laughs> We're gonna check out the sundries and the rest of the lobby. All right, that concludes our adventure today, getting to Atlanta from La Los Angeles. I was gonna say Las Vegas, but Los Angeles. Yeah, it's kind of weird saying LA instead of Las Vegas, but it actually was not a bad day at all. It was probably one of the smoothest travel days we've had in a long time, and we even had a fly through a hurricane. Yeah, we had a couple of small stints of uh, turbulence. There was once where the cranberry drink that Nacy was drinking almost spilled out, but other than that, that was pretty good. And it was only like 10, maybe 15 minutes for each little stint, and there was probably only like two or three of them. So a really smooth day. We got here, we had STK for dinner last night in the hotel, just kind of lounged around the hotel for the night. Yeah, it's actually, I mean, it's a nice hotel. You guys will have to stick around and uh, look out for our hotel review of yeah. this hotel. Uh, is it full JW Marriott luxury? I don't know about that, but it was a nice day. So if you like this video, hit that thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. And ring that notification bell so you get notified when we do at least three videos a week. And we'll come and get you guys for the next one. Ain't that the truth? Baby Ruth. Bye, Bye everyone. Everybody.